Has women's gender roles changed? All right, y'all. We got another Hey Willow Wednesdays. The mask is back. The mask is back. What? What? The mask is back. The mask is back. What? What? Undeniable name of international amazing demo. Never been a lame mm. <laughs> It's your boy, that boy Bari. <laughs> and I'm that pretty motherfucker, aka your baby father, wish he could be me, Jay Willer, the podcast killer, aka podcast poppy, aka the reach. pod father. And guess what? I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. This right here, this is one of the Wednesdays, man. We about to give you some ghetto news from your relationship gurus. Bow. Bow, 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 bow. Yeah. What's the word, brother? Is the, oh, gunshots. I just, I just want to shout out to the fact that my gun got better. Okay. I, I respect <laughs> it. I respect it. Y'all got me working on my gun signs. Yes, is I'm it, from Chicago. But I normally have a, but now I'm like, oh shit, we got two. Is it, why you, is, you I want to know up, why, I want to keep with you. <laughs> you can't have your fingers spread like that though. You, you gotta put them together. Oh, that's a, oh, it's yeah, a yeah, you feel you me? Your man Dave gun look like a two year old gun. I, I'm when from the suburbs, <laughs> god damn it. When your, son, when your son be like, daddy, I got a gun, look. You like bow, bow, bow. I'm from the suburbs, nigga. Bro, nigga look like he about to cut somebody. Like he about to cut somebody. Like daddy, look. Oh. Rock paper scissors head ass. Okay. Right, right, right. You got it. <laughs> All right. Hey, yo, what's Rock. the word, my brothers? How was your week? Talk to me, man. Talk to me. I'm saying it's always Dame first. Go ahead, get your shit off, team. Honestly, I'm still on ten from the verses. I'm not gonna front. I thought it was awesome. Um, make sure you peep our. Uh, review of the verses between the locks and uh, I'm sorry, D block and this yeah. step. it was fucking amazing. I'm still on it 10. Was. It was, I'm still on 10 about that personally, the way I feel. So, um, yeah, that's where I'm at right now. That's the only thing on my brain right now. I thought it was okay. Awesome. okay. So, let's get it. That boy, Barry, how you feeling, brother? Um. Feel good, you know what I'm saying? I've been doing, I feel a little tired. Like I was at the gym all week. I, I all wish week. you would talk slightly louder because I can't hear you. Oh, I... okay, I'm sorry. Well, I'm a little tired because this week is PL week at the gym, personal best, you know what I'm saying? I've hit two out of my three goals. I didn't hit the third one, but it's all good, you know what I'm saying? But okay, nonetheless, I'm tired, but I feel good. Heard it. Yeah, facts, 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 facts. Hit two out of the three goals. The third one I failed, but it's all good nonetheless. But listen, failure isn't failure. Failure is a lesson. Oh no, yeah, that's a fact. But the main ones I hit, so that's all I care about. No, or sometimes you just fucking fail. I mean, listen. no, and that's what I'm saying. I <laughs> failed the third one. The third one I failed. I ain't even gonna play that's myself. Right, brother. I, I, the listen, third one I failed. Like we're we not even gonna listen. sit here and make it seem like, <laughs> oh, but you tried really hard. No, you failed. No that consolation shit. I prizes. That shit. No, no, no. The two out of the three, I caught the bench. I, I, I hit the personal best on the bench. Dell, if I hit the personal bench in terms of uh um uh lat pulls, failed bad, 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 bad. bad, bad. I mean, listen, I, you sound in French to me. I don't even know what you're talking about. But I, I no, I caught the bench the press. You know what I'm saying bench press. I caught my, I caught a personal best. You know what I'm saying that looks I did. Friday is is squat, so we go. We're praying on that one. We're going to see how All that right. goes. We're promoting health on Will of Wednesday. Oh, that's a fact. That's a fact. Health a fact. positivity. We gonna, well, we'll I'll let y'all know show, next week. I have a, a real life question as far as the person like you who's beginning your, your you know, your um, 
not even beginning at this point, continuing your gym journey. Do you mm-hmm. have a goal? Or, or are you just trying to be the biggest nigga ever to walk? No, it's at this point, nah, it's not even, I don't even want to be just, big, No, no but I'm serious. I, I'm not even trying to, like, I'm just. I'm, yeah. I'm starting to realize, like, you don't, lifting weights doesn't make you necessarily big as if you eat more is what's going to make you big. I could lift all the weights in the world. I could lift 400, 500 pounds and still be the same size I am. So it's not until like, like, what's the goal? Um, Are you trying to get bigger? Like, you just want like no, I don't want to necessarily be like bigger. you said. It's couch just, look. Like you know, what I'm saying you want your shoulders right. to be couches and your legs to be trucks. No, like, what is I just the goal? How, how, how much do you weigh and what's your end goal? Is what he's saying. You trying to get three fifty? You know what I'm no, saying? I'm now, right now. Here with it? Right now, I'm um right now I'm one ninety seven. They Jeez. call what? What they call in workout, they call standing weight, where you have to be able to bench 225, squat 225, deadlift 225, and shoulder press 225. I could do three out of the four. I can't shoulder press 225. But you like five foot eight, so you trying to be obese. What? No, no, no. When you say shoulder press, you got to be able to take a bar and shoulder actually press no, 225. I'm, I'm just your going shoulder. over your height. And the goal that you're trying to set. No, you're but you gotta to remember. A, a I know I, that's what that's what my weight is now, but that doesn't mean that's the weight I want to be. I want to drop weight, of course. So that's what I'm trying to say. So Dane was asking, what is your goal? Uh, I want to probably get to about. I want to get to about 180, 175, 180. Probably 180. Okay. Okay. And then so, after that, probably. What? So you, what so, you gonna so, ask? so that means right now you fat. Considered by the spectrum of yes, I'm I'm overweight for what I I'm want. I'm not trying yes. to make that a joke. I, I'm really just no for what I want for what yeah. I want to be. Yes, I'm overweight. I want to drop to about 17 pounds and then. Do you do any cardio? Yeah, but that that's what I'm saying. It it all drops. Everything I do is a work in form is in terms of dropping weight. Dropping weight, you could drop weight from just lifting weights. Most people think you got to do cardio to drop weight. You don't have to do cardio to drop weight. I could legit. Drop weight from just lifting weights. All you have to do is change your diet. Dropping weight is from diet, not from running. You know what I'm saying? Most people don't get that. Mm. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm with it. I'm just, once again, I just want to say, my bad. I'm just curious. Like, think, um, uh, Jay just dropped out the shit, so we're not recording right now. Oh, I'm, about back. Say, I'm, but, back. I'm back. Okay. But look at it like this, Dame. I'm going to prove you a point. You do keto, right? You don't lift no weights, and you lost mad weight. You know what I'm saying? So you don't necessarily need to do cardio to lose weight. All you have to do is no, really no. changing. It's diet. You changing. It's changing your diet that makes you lose the weight. It's not the cardio. Most people think you got to run a billion miles or ride a bike a billion miles or whatever to lose right. weight. No, it's literally to lose weight for real. You got to change your diet. Once you change your diet, you lose weight. Yeah, and, and, that's and real. I was, no, that's real. You know, and, and, and I was just gonna, I was just gonna, yeah, no, in real life, um. To lose weight is literally diet. I agree with you 100%. And a lot of you know people, I'm saying? Yo, we really just don't get that as people. Like, you can right. change your people diet, wanna, lose weight. People yeah. think that, oh, I got to run a, a five miles a day and, and do know. all this to, and lift a billion weights to lose weight. No, 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 no. If you legit curb, like, for example, I saw something that people have been passing around. Are we recording now? My bad. I see for back? the month of August, we're people back? say people. Yeah, we back. We back. We it's back. Ghetto, but we back. Did we bit? Okay, I don't know. I'm sorry. Um, for the month of August, people been saying, "Yo, no sugar, no liquor, no fast food." Um, no liquor, no liquor, no, no sugar, oh, no liquor, no sugar, no. no fast food, no sex, and no masturbation for the month of August. No told, sex. Oh, and no masturbation. I guess I will never be in shape. Fuck y'all. Fuck that. Fuck no, no, you. it's not about being. What? That part is not about being in shape. They claim I'll that be you bad know. Ever. You, what? <laughs> Niggas, my, cardio, <laughs> my cardio is amazing because I can go rounds. You're wilding. What? But listen, fuck listen, you. listen. You be a, Nick, go ahead, lift all the weights in the world, and you can't go a second round. No, listen, I'll nigga rounds, said nigga, the niggas. The niggas said well, from where I saw it, they said, listen, you not having sex and not masturbating or getting a nut for a month. It gives you clarity and focus. Remember when? No, um, shout out to La- Sh- shout out to Els Lamar. Remember when he was telling us about semen retention, and you, you and 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 you're holding in your semen, give and me the, you give keeping me the, give your me the semen. List again. Wait, I'm, I'm one more time. 
Oh, the list. Okay. Um, I'm. A, it's no, um. Man, man. It's no sugar. No sugar. No liquor. No liquor. No fast food. No fast food. No sex. No sex. Lost and me. No masturbation. Yeah, Lost man. me. No yes. sex. Yo, wildin'. Nah, cause with that type of energy, niggas is building houses by hand, like one. No, house. yeah, you're, you're, I'm sorry. <laughs> if, if, if that's what it takes to get in shape, I don't want to be in shape. No, 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 that's not to get in shape. Out. That's not that's not the part to get in shape. That's yeah, just that, out. that's the thing more, that I've been seeing to, for mental. <laughs> that's the thing I've been seeing to just for just for men to just get focused. That's not for the in shape part. Right. The in shape part. I'm focused. The in shape part. The in shape part is the no sugar. The in shape part is the no sugar, no liquor, no fast food. That's the in shape part. You see this? You see this? There's no way I'm getting into the bed talking about nah, I ain't having no sex right now. I what the fuck is you talking about? So let about? me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question right now. If you was to say to your significant other, Willa, yo, hey, baby, real talk, I want to go 30 days without sex. What you think she'd say? She would say, what the fuck disease do I have? Because I can't go 30 days without sex. Are you dumb? What? 30 days? You know what? Let's start the fucking show. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not about to be angry right now. You're wild. 30 days for what? Yo, Willa, can I ask you can I ask you for a homework assignment for Willa Wednesdays, right? I'm not going 30 days without sex, no. No, no, that's not what I was about to say. A homework assignment, right? I want you to just fake try and tell that to your to your significant no, other I'm not, just to why see would what I she fake said. And do that. I like to have sex more than anybody. What? 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 Yo, start the show. Mediator, moderator, road call, select decision, temporary lover, always toxic, half a gas station pill, Bari. What the fuck are we talking oh about? Because you're wild right now. God. How am I wild? You are wild. Listen, I, I listen, must prank. abstain from sex with the. Oh, I'm a Mormon? I didn't say okay. to do it. I would just say all I'm I said is to just say, nun, all huh? I said all I said to is just to say it to her just to see what she would say. Just be Why like, would oh, I baby, do I'm that? Like, it's not believable because uh, I don't believe it. <laughs> what? That's crazy, bro. You tripping? That's well, crazy. I mean, we all we all grow and change. I mean, I think what? it's possible. It's it's possible to say we're well, here something. I just want to try one month. I mean, you know this this, this thing that here that you just showed. Hey forever, Willa, if bro. I was a bet, if I was to bet you a thousand, you know no, no, wait, 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 but Willa, I'm... if I bet you a thousand dollars, if I bet you a thousand dollars to go without sex for a month, would you do it? What the fuck is a thousand dollars, bro? Like, so come on, so you... <laughs> come so on, ten thousand. A thousand. So that's not good enough for me. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's not good enough for me. Yo, Dave. Nah, <laughs> Dave. I take it. Nigga, what? Oh. Ten thousand. It's not good enough for me. What, what are we talking me. about? It is for me. Niggas make ten. I mean, niggas make ten k in the weekend. What are we talking right, about? Cool. So keep making your ten k plus another ten k off just doing that. Yeah, I, I'm Listen, good. It's, it's okay. It's okay. I, I'd rather bust the nut with yo, my Willa, lady. Yo, 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 Dave. Sure, Dave, he talking to us. Remember, Dave, he talking to us. It's all good, bro. It's all we good. We know the truth, man. It's all good. Don't remember. Well, what anyway. What are we talking about, moderator? Because y'all want to. <laughs> so, mask, masks are back in New Uh-oh. York, in Atlanta, Uh-oh. Uh-oh. in um, California, Uh-oh. in Florida. Prayers to Florida Damn. because Florida has the highest number of COVID cases in the United States, period, right now. And period. It's COVID, though. It ain't more, even COVID. It's more the, than New York. Because remember, at one point, more yeah. than remember, at one point, New York had the highest number ever, but now all of a sudden, Florida has the highest case, the numbers. Think each, period. I think each city, each city took their chance. Like each city had their little. Yeah, little, but no, right now I heard Florida is bugging. Like they out there wilding. Like they begging for help. Like help me, please, help me, please. So, everybody, prayers to Florida. Whoever, if you have family members and friends in Florida, prayers to them because they going through it over there. California is back on lockdown. Um, I heard Atlanta. Y'all gotta wear we masks back. again. We um, back. Yeah, the the mask well, mandate is back in Atlanta, but I, in New York, is different. They, right. And they today, over here. Look, Cuomo. Today, Cuomo is over here. Whatever, well. yeah, Cuomo was like, "Yo, if you're not vaccinated, there's no indoor right. dining. There's no right. gyms." Oh shit! No, right. There's no. They nothing. just sent. They just sent. They just sent the message to uh, um um um. 
people in the gym, people that. have been posting it on on their gram that if you not you have to prove show proof of vaccination card in order for you to come into the gyms. Get the fuck um, out of here. I don't know about the I don't know about the restaurant thing, but we're gonna discuss that a little later. We're gonna get to that. Uh, we, we we definitely gonna talk about it because now you infringing on people's rights. But we'll all right, no, we're gonna talk. What we're gonna talk about. We're gonna talk about it. We're gonna talk about it. Um, women gender roles. You know what I'm saying? Um, t- in today's quick. day and age, young ladies are getting to the bag and rightfully so. They working two jobs, three jobs, or they got that one job that's paying all their bills, taking care of their nails, buying their car, their clothes, whatever they got to do. Shout out to the ladies working hard, getting to the bag. So gender roles have changed. Ladies are not looking for a man to be dependent upon to take care of their situation. So now, because of that, should what... Should what we require of women change as well? Because they, the gender roles have changed. I think I asked that right. Yes, I did. Nah, ask but, right. nah, no, sounds good. That was, a good. that was a good question. That's a fair question. Right. Cool, 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 cool. So we're going to talk about that. Um, The baby, you know, he's been in the news lately, wilding, saying some real obscure things, saying some outlandish things, and he's losing a lot of money because of it. So we're going to talk about that as well. Um, and also, we got a Hey Willow Wednesdays. I, a Hey Willow Wednesdays. So, shout out to that as well. Damn, so Madison Wade, wait. the drops. Oh, we got gongs. Yeah, we got yeah, gongs. We got gongs. We got gongs. Let's hit that gong. Ha ha, so sorry. I like it. Ha ha, so sorry. That's racist, racist. Sorry, That was racist. racist. It is. I'm sorry. Yeah, I, apologize. I apologize. Yeah. I apologize. No, you need to apologize to the whole Asian community before we get canceled. I apologize to all Asian people. I wasn't trying to be funny. I kind of was, but I apologize once again. Still, nonetheless. Racist, bro. It was supposed to be a joke, <laughs> but it wasn't funny. Apologies. You know what I'm saying? I will apologize for that. <laughs> but y'all laugh. That's all that matters. But anyway, um. <laughs> Let's get talk about the mask real quick. Masks are back. COVID is still here. It's still running rampant. It is still... I haven't heard of the numbers of people dying, but I have heard the cases of COVID going up. Florida is at an all-time high. Um, California is back on lockdown, like I said. Um, mm. Atlanta, y'all got to wear masks over there. New York City, our cases are going up. Uh, Arkansas, oh, that's the next place. Arkansas um, is at an all-time high as well. The only reason I know that is because, shout out to my mom, they asked her to go to Arkansas for nurses in yeah. Arkansas for the Delta variant of COVID. I didn't know so, that. Yeah, you yeah, know Arkansas. Why, you know why I hate the English language? Yeah. I hate the English language because Kansas is Kansas. But if you add an AR to it, it's Arkansas. It should be our Kansas. But I what? digress. What? If you add an AR to Kansas, is it's Kansas, right? Right. If you add an AR to Kansas, it turns into Arkansas. It should Kansas. be our Kansas. It's the same word. But you know what? I, I shut up. That's my I'm sorry. Part. No. Since what we the are fuck are remote, you talking about? No, since we are remote, the jokes can't move as fast, and I fucking hate it. But I definitely understand. No, it, it, it's stupid. If you add an ER or an AR to kids. AR. Wait. So, oh. so gonna, I, I call, I just called that. Okay. A okay. No, no, I just called but, it. But, I was like, huh? So so let me so no, so let's say the same thing, right? Kansas. If you put my name D R D A, if you put D A R as Darkinsaw, why? Why is it not the Kansas? The Kansas. <laughs> like, what the fuck? No, I ain't gonna hold you. I didn't stupid, catch on to what you idea. meant it's until just stupid. now. I'm like, it's why would you stupid. add an AR to Kansas? And I was like, oh, you put it in the front. My bad. I apologize. It's, it's okay. I had a, it's okay. I had a I, slow I, I moment. I, yeah, you did. You did. You did. I had a slow Slightly. moment. Right. It's okay. Oh, slow moment. so well, well, I tell y'all. By the way, um, that's where my family is from originally, from the you Arkansas, know, Arkansas, Kansas. No, Arkansas. I don't know what Arkansas is. You know what, Wade? That's the name of that episode. No, no, Wade. That's the name of this episode. R Kansas. A R Dash Kansas. That's the name of the That's not the name of the episode. It's no. It's not working. Don't do that, Wade. It's a little lame. Stop that. That's a dub. That's not happening. 
Listen, I'm. I, I, Kansas. But anyway, no, but um, yeah, no, it, it is terrible that um, it's coming back. Um, I, yeah, I really prayers to everybody involved with that. For I real, just, real, uh, real, I just, real. I was just having a conversation with a nurse, and I, and she once she told me she was a nurse here in Atlanta. You know, we moved. I, I live in Atlanta now, mm-hmm. and I was talking to an Atlanta nurse. This is one of the hot spots, and she was telling me because I asked, I was like, "Is this Delta variant really real?" Because the Delta variant sound like it's not like one of them the movies with like Harrison Ford. The Delta variant, and you know, with, with Liam Neeson, yeah, Liam Neeson and Harrison Ford, and, and he got one of them crazy lines like, I'm gonna get you tomorrow, you know, and it's like, oh, yeah. the Delta, the Delta variant, you know, and so she was like, nah, but the shit is real. She was like, motherfuckers are really dying. Um, oh, shit, shout out to Lamar because he had a concept to, to uh, because people are still dying from the Delta variant, and these are people who have been vaccinated. Right, and they've been pushing the, the fucking vaccination to everybody. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, I, 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 I go a step further. Um, they said that in Massachusetts, the Delta variant is running rampant, but 74 mm-hmm. percent of the people have been vaccinated. Yep. So, the 74. Vac- yeah, 74, which is crazy. You will pass a high school, you get your you'll get your high school diploma with a 74. So, <laughs> you know, you, 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 you'll get, you get the diploma with a 74. So, Lord, Lord knows I did. You feel me? So, to get your diploma and still die, is the vaccine relevant? Is the vaccine good? So, is from the what I something that, that we should be aiming for, if you can still catch this shit, like what's going on with this vaccine that you can still catch some shit and die? Why are they pushing the vaccine so hard? From I what I was told, from what I was told from uh, medical professionals, is that at first it was supposed to prevent it, but now that what they've re- from now what they've realized is that it doesn't prevent it. All it does is it it stops you from getting the worst part of COVID. So if let's say you do catch it, you won't get the severity of it in terms of ending up going in the hospital with respiratory issues and things like that. Now, like I said, I'm not saying. I'm not over here promoting anybody to take the, the, the vaccine. Um, I took the vaccine, but the only reason I took it is because my mom asked me to. But from what I'm hearing now is that they're telling people that they're going to end up within another year. T- in about a couple months, they're going to ask everybody who already took the vaccine to take it again. I'm not doing that. I'm not about to take another dose of another of a vaccine. I mean, but, but bro, you, at this point, you have no choice. Your vaccine is now outdated. You have to uh, update I'm, your vaccine but, like an iPhone, my nigga. You got vaccine but I'm 1.0. Not, but no, but you what I'm saying is, I'm 2.0. me personally, I'm not, that I'm not doing. I already took it once, and I thought this was going to be the one time that I needed to take it. But now at this point, if you're telling me but that now I have to. that's why I'm not taking it. What the no, fuck and, is going on here? And, and, and but this is why I'm saying I'm I'm with, I'm, I didn't want to take it in the beginning. I only took it off of good faith. Now I'm at the point where I'm not taking it anymore. It, it. They're, the things that they're doing to get people to take it, they're giving, at my job, they're giving people $100 gift cards to fucking take a vaccine. Now Yo, they're talking the about if... The incentives are crazy to get a vaccine. I saw another thing on Instagram where they're saying, hey, if, if you want, you could get $2,500. I don't know if it's real or not. You could get $2,500 if you know somebody who doesn't have the vaccine and you tell the city of New York. I don't know how that's we, real or not. It's snitching now. I, forgot. I don't know how real that is, but that that that's that's where we. I'm like, yo, there's no way that's real. I'm sitting back pretty and far. And to take it y'all, even, real quick, and to even take okay? it further, no. yeah, yeah we, we for sure. You, okay, you okay, no, I'm sitting back. Okay. To even take it further to the next point, restaurants are requiring people in New York City now. If you want to dine in at these restaurants, you have to have a vaccine card. And I had or this go conversation. To the gym. Or to go to the gym, you have to have or a vaccine go to card. A concert. And I said to people at work, I said, this is probably one of the biggest HIPAA violations that I've ever seen in my life. No, because it's, no, it's, no... It's, 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 it's actually past that. It's constitutional. Now, you cannot, now you cannot people, ask people you, to give telling, up their personal information. You're telling free people, right? Free. We're free, right? So if you're telling free people that the government is not going to interfere with your everyday regular life, but now you're saying... If you're not vaccinated, you can't go to school or you can't go to summer camp or you can't go eat out in public. 
That's it gets nuts. to a point now. It's like, so what the fuck is really going on? Because if we living in communism, then tell me that. <laughs> Say that. Yeah. If, that, if, that, if, that. if you're a czar and we living in the fucking whatever the czar just does. Keep it, yeah, just keep it a bucket. Like, tell me that you want to. Yeah, keep it a bucket. Tell me that you want some fuck shit. So everything, then say yeah. that. But don't tell me that we free and we got a democracy when obviously we don't. Because now in yeah. New York, you can't even go to fucking Red Lobster and eat <laughs> if you're not vaccinated. What? My thing is, all right, in real life, you just fucked me up because you took me back to seventh grade social studies. Yeah. I was like, czar, communism, yeah. like, Nazis, Germany. Yeah. Wow. I, I haven't thought about that shit in years. Right. But, but, it, like, but that, that's where we going. <laughs> he right. He's bro. He, that's he's that's right. where we're going. The government is now saying you can't do these basic social things if you're if you don't got the mark of the beast. And I'll say it. I don't mean to get biblical, but now it's the mark of the beast. It's communism and the mark of the beast. I, like I said, I, I'm outside. I don't give a fuck what nobody got to say. If I'm the yeah. radical one, that, if I'm well, the radical that's one, then I'll be the radical one. But that's not well, tell me, that's in New York I, right now. It's not in I, it's not in Atlanta. It's only they only take that's only taking place in New York right now. Of, of, it's not okay, taking place and, anywhere and, else. And where do you think the rest of the country gets their stuff from? Illuminati. I just point out words. Stupid. <laughs> the, 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 the bigger cities, <laughs> well, yeah. aka New York, Los Angeles, um, Atlanta. Somewhere in Texas is another big city. Pittsburgh is another big city. Like we, we are the the the, the pacemakers. We set the trends. So if we're doing it, you don't think that rural small town America gonna adopt that same principle? That's what we do. We're, no, well, they what I will with say us because we have the most people around. And if it works with us, it's gonna work for the rest of the country. So, but wait. if you if you lock up everything else in these major cities, and you make it that your kid can't go to school without a vaccine, or you can't go eat at Denny's without a vaccine, what do you think is gonna happen with rural America? But here's the Low problem. Keto, I think you need a vaccine to eat at Denny's. By the way, I mean, I feel like anybody that eats. Okay, I'm joking, but uh, no, Listen, but I get what you're saying. I do get what but you're saying. A, but here's the problem. Here's the here, but here's the here's the problem that that here's the flaw in what you're saying, right? Denny's way you make all sense. You make sense with what you're saying if 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 people in rural America are the ones who wanted to take the vaccine. The problem is is that people in rural America don't want to take the vaccine. That I'm keeping. That's not my point at all, Barry. No, yo, you're saying no, he's that people. A point. No, yeah, you're, you're making you're, a totally different point. No, but what I'm saying is you're saying that the the world or America is going to follow suit after um the major cities. The big cities. And what I'm right. saying is they're not. You want to know why? Because the the small cities don't want to take the vaccine at all, and that's the major problem that the government oh, oh, oh. is having okay, so, with everything else. So one one thing I'm going to say, my friend, that you're failing to understand and failing to realize, this is a bigger picture at play, right? So when we're talking no, about, right. wait, 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 there, just hear me out. When we're talking about um, your local governments and we're talking about mm -hmm. the presidential elections, we're talking about the elective college, right? Now, if you live in New York, you have more electoral votes than if you live in fucking Idaho or some, some obscure small town in the United States, right? So I'm what happens is that. if you live in New York, you'll have 17 electoral college votes or 25 electoral or electoral college votes. Whatever right? the number is. Yeah. Whatever the okay. number. So that okay. number means something. So the reason why if you can propose something in New York or Atlanta or Houston or Los Angeles or whatever big city, big town that I'm saying is, if it can work there, all they're going to do is just adopt that into small town no. America. I because understand. We have, wait, wait. We have more electoral college votes. So if it works there where you have 35 votes, of course it's going to work where there's two fucking votes because we don't care about these small ass towns, is what I'm saying. Well, I get that, Willa. I understand that premise. But what I'm saying is those towns with the two electoral votes, nobody wants to take the vaccine yet. And they don't mean shit on the grand scheme. That's well, what I'm saying. But, that, but Willa, it's not a. I understand what you're saying, but what you're missing the point is he at this point. What they're trying to, 
What they're trying to get now is they're trying to get a mass number of people to get vaccinated. Period, right? Yeah, so so and herd immunity can kick in, yes. Exactly. That's what they that's what they think will happen eventually scientifically, right? Yes. Which logic theoretically it'll make sense. But yeah, what the problem is you're right. So now they're saying, you know what, in New York, if we say everybody gets to get vaccinated in New York City, you can't you can't come into a restaurant. Cool. People in Texas is like, cool, if you don't tell us that we gotta get vaccinated and go to restaurants, we won't fucking go. You can't that's, say text. So, so listen, far, listen, what, listen, what, wait, what wait, 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 wait. I let you speak. I let you speak. I let you speak. I let you speak. What I'm saying is these people are so against the vaccine is that at, in these rural states that they will not take it at all. You could put any rules that you want to put in place. They will not take it. And even the legislators at the present point in time in Texas, the same country, Texas, they're telling people, listen, we're not even going to pass a, a, a face mask law. They're letting children go to school without face masks. These understood. niggas don't care about a vaccine. Understood. This is what but I'm trying to say to you. Understood. But what I'm saying is you're naming a majority within a majority. You're, you, can't, you can't fight that, I'm, right? What, what, Arkansas what I'm is the same is, way. Wait, Kansas wait, 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 is the same go. way. I let, go. I let you go. I let you go. What I'm saying is a majority against a majority is still the majority. What I'm talking about is the majority against the minority, right? You can't say shit. New York and Texas. That's two superpowers bumping heads. What Arkansas I'm saying is the same is, way. No, no, what I'm saying is if this is adopted, right? How Cuomo mm -hmm. just pushed this whole shit that you can't go. It starts in August, right? I'm, is it August? This month? September, this month? September 13th. It starts cool. September 13th. In September, New York, which is arguably the biggest city, state, county country whatever you want to fucking call it in the united states if they adopt this whole ideology of you got to be vaccinated to go into blah 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 the smaller cities have no choice but to follow that rule because of the power and the influence that these bigger states have so if you go texas and new york cool it's a superpower against the superpower but if you go New York, which is clearly going to adopt it because they already passed it, and then you go to fucking Des Moines, Iowa, what the fuck do you think is going to happen? They have no choice but to follow status quo because the bigger superpowers is going that way. That's what I'm trying to say. I don't, I don't I care don't if you so. don't if you don't like it in Montana, you could not like it, but you're the minority. No, I'm talking about <laughs> legislation. Don't. But one thing I've realized is that legislation, legislation just literally because goes of that way. Because just, everybody's loyal to their party. So if their party is going that way, they're going to go that well, you way. Well, you got to remember, all these motherfuckers don't like Cuomo as is. I'm you got to also take Cuomo. that into consideration. I'm not talking Cuomo. That's legend, but he's a part of legislation, bro. He's a, I don't want to turn this into... I'm, no, no, we're not going to go political, but I'm just telling you how shit works, right? So the way shit works is people fall along their party lines. So it's either you're they democratic... Could. Or you're Republican. That's literally it, right? We got, True, but this... Dumb niggas, ran, dumb niggas ran into the Capitol on January 6th, and half the world is still like, well, I see nothing wrong with it. Why? Because they're falling along their party lines. Because if they don't say that, they're not going to be reelected. But what happens is, is now, if this is the status quo going forward, and the Democratic Party is like, yo, we're going to have mandates, and dumb shits is closed down, what do you think is going to happen in small-town America that's Democratic? They're gonna have no know. choice but to I, fall I, in line. I don't think so, but okay. nonetheless. So the, I, I, okay, I don't so think it, so. You so think. then you don't know politics. I'll say that. No, I just <laughs> I disagree. No, I just disagree. I just want to say it's that. not that. It's just I disagree because it's just it's two different, bro. At this point, people, this COVID, this COVID pandemic has changed people's thought process on how to do things so much. So there's so now, many politics. people in, bro, I, people in politics are so against so many things when it comes onto this vaccine that people are legitimately saying, no, fuck that shit. That's why I'm saying, yo, bro, I, I understand what you're saying and it would, I, I get it. Logically, it makes sense. But I, I, from what I'm seeing in terms and from what I'm hearing, even on the, in terms of the medical field, a lot of people are not with that shit. In those same rural, in those same rural states, people are like, yo, bro, I'm not with the shit. 
They still have passed laws where you don't have to wear masks in Arkansas, in Kansas. Those same small towns, niggas is like, cool. Even with the, even with the numbers being at all time high, these niggas is like, cool. I hear you, but there's no, there's no mask mandate. We're, gonna, we're still going to pass yeah. a law that says you don't got to wear masks in school. What? Niggas is out here straight up having double COVID and y'all niggas is still not going to pass a, co- uh, um, at least a mask law? Y'all going to let niggas just walk up and down in front of each other, no wait, six wait, feet. Double, double COVID? Double <laughs> COVID, nigga. Niggas got the first COVID and Delta. These niggas is wildin'. You got... Yeah, and this, yeah. That shit, that shit called the Dovid, nigga. You got the, the Dovid. Dovid, nigga. The, Come nah, on, son. The niggas is out here... Nigga. You got the dope. Niggas is walking around with double like COVID, and guess like what? Yeah, they don't have yeah, no. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What you know what I'm saying? You? Niggas what is walking is? around with double COVID, terrible. double COVID, and they not. And, and these. Co- dove it. And the country, and the countries, double and the states COVID. is still not passing no laws dove talking about masks. Okay, that was Come bad. Come on, bro. Once again. Wow. That was even Yeah, he got to get one weed. <laughs> There you go, <laughs> wait. Thank you. Worse. Listen, was, I, what I will say, joke, nah, but you ain't saved Wait, I tried to save it. Don't what save I will me. say, I don't want to be saved. <laughs> okay, my bad, J Cole. My bad. What me. I will say <laughs> is, everybody is getting crazy out here in these streets. Be safe. Protect yourself. Be smart. Make sound choices with whatever you want to do. At the, end, like, of, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, this this is about to totally go against the Constitution. Oh people yeah, for sure. Will be for sure. Because people for are going to sure. say they don't want it, and they're going to be forced. So Yo, this, we're, we're not talking I, you about know what the, you want to. Right. I was going to say this earlier. You want to know when this shit is going to really fuck people up, and then, and they're not going to do it anymore. There's going to be somebody. There's going to be one rich white person that's going to be like, "You're violating my rights," and they're going to sue. And the moment they sue, and that motherfucker gonna have money for real. And once they do that, oh no, we can't do this no more. We can't ask the motherfucker to walk in with a COVID vaccination card to tell me he has something. You know what that's like? That's like me telling you, hey, every time I come around you, Willa, I gotta tell you if I got an STD or not. Well, no, I, I, I'm, I'm gonna tell you what's gonna happen because it's already happening. Niggas are just gonna start paying for fake ass vaccination cards, right? Oh no, oh, oh, for sure. I already bought two of them. I, I, I got one lined up. My vax card is lit. I can fly wherever I want to fly. Two. I can go wherever I want to go. I can eat out. I can go to the gym. I can do whatever I want because I got a vax card. Is that shit legal? No. You will pay no, no. And that's what's time. about you to making happen. yourself so hot. You tell me, You're making I, yourself I hot. I don't care. How can you tell me that my vaccination call now real? I, I, I tell think. people all the time. I thought he was about to pull one out. He said like this. I tell people all the time. Nah, <laughs> nah, nah, nah. I thought he was about to. I thought he was like, yo, hey, check this out. I got my shit right here, cuz. I thought he was about to. <laughs> I tell people all the time. If they say, are you vaccinated? I just tell them I am so that they be like, all right, brother, you got it. I'm like, see how easy that was? Yeah. Bro, this, at the end of the day, this shit corny, and no, this shit is corny, and it's not gonna stop because there's too many rights. And when niggas have rights, we about to exercise these rights. You can't tell right. me that I gotta do this, I gotta do that, I can't do this, I can't do that. No, that's unconstitutional. Don't be real. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta end this COVID conversation. Let's wrap it up. Yeah, man. Everybody, um, please be safe. We got Be this. safe. Be smart. Is getting worse out here. All I can ask is everybody protect yourself 100%. Praise to everybody that's going through this COVID, especially the Delta variant, because it's, it's it's wicked out here in these streets. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I guess. So, yeah. yeah. No, hey, listen, I don't pray. No, I pray nobody get that COVID shit. I had it. My mom had it. That shit was a real life changer. So, please, everybody, I want you, everybody to be safe. Nobody, nobody catch COVID. I don't want nobody catch COVID. All, all I gotta say, all I gotta say is if barring you as a vaccinated American, if you mm-hmm. catch COVID again, best believe I'm mm-hmm. on my fucking soapbox. Okay? I'm on my high horse. I'm talking the shit of shits. I think I gotta agree. What? No, bro, if you the listen, check this out. out. Yo, get that yo, shot. Get listen, that vaccine, I, yo, get hey, that what I will say, watch, watch this. Get that Tuskegee I, I, Airmen shit the fuck out of here. I'm not with the shits. Fuck I, you. I will that. say this. I took the vaccine, right? 
I must agree. If, I must agree. I, just if I I took the vaccine, if I get COVID and I if end up you in get COVID a, again, listen, look, listen. If I I get the vaccine, if you get if I the get Delta COVID, variant. You can't if I get COVID, planes, if I get COVID, listen to me. You if I Delta, nigga, you, if I no, get no, COVID, no, listen. No, I'm, wait, y'all don't even know what I'm about to say. You, listen, it's Dave, you don't know what I'm about to say. Airlines, nigga, you can't get the Delta. Listen, that is if crazy. I get if I get COVID and I got the vaccine <laughs> and I end up in a hospital, Delta. God forbid I knock on wood, bro. I promise you, nobody can tell me I will never get vaccinated again. Polio, bro, he- hepatitis B, you gotta C, get the D. Spirit variant, bro. Not- <laughs> <laughs> Like, oh, you see where I was going. <laughs> you you gotta get it. the spirit variant, bro. <laughs> bro, if bro you I'm telling you. Delta variant? I'm nah. Like, nigga, like, I ain't fucking with Delta, nigga. You, you gotta, gotta catch that. the Virgin American. You gotta variant. get that. Yes, yes, bro. yes. You gotta, get, <laughs> bro. you gotta get the Frontier variant. Bro. Do That's not it. catch the Delta variant. You gotta get that, that was it, that, that Air Jamaica variant, my nigga. Like, you cannot be Air Jamaica. Air Jamaica has not been around for some years. Don't do that. I don't that. know what it is. You fuck around, call it TWA. At the end of the day, <laughs> you can't get this fucking Delta. Delta, Delta's oh, every What are you in Delta for? Nah, that um, is funny as shit. Press the Yo, gong, Delta wait. Airlines gotta close down. In closing, I know Delta tight, like Delta mad. They're like, why it got to be Press called Delta? Wait. <laughs> All right, man. What's next? <laughs> Let's talk women gender roles. Okay, I like I like this one. I like this one. Um, I just want to say that. I'm, wait, I'm before you read it, because I want you to read it verbatim. But I actually saw it. On, it was actually a post, and I'm I'm happy to say it. Fuck it, I got off social media. But it was a post that a girl made, and it and it sparked such a great conversation, and that's why I was like, I got to say it. So I just want to, I, I personally want to say that because I like why I found it. But if you can just read it, I think it's dope. Um, gender roles have changed since 1960. Well, Most women, pro- I said gender roles. Oh, gender roles. Got you. I'm gonna start over for Dame, okay? <laughs> for the Delta. For the Delta. Gender Yo, that roles. Was all the on. Delta, Delta, Delta. We rock the Delta, Delta. Delta. Now, what's crazy is all they got Delta Sigma roles. They all pissed. Yeah. Like anybody with Delta in their name is upset. Change your name. I'm not joining that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, imagine being Greek for like 20 years. You're like, oh, come on. Like we did, we did. We the rock same. Delta, Delta, <laughs> Delta. We rock and Delta. Can I Delta. just read what this says first? Oh. Nope. What she's gonna say? COVID? Nah. All right. Um. Can I? I'm gonna read it. <laughs> do you want a vaccination? No. No. Do you, do you want a vaccination? All right. All right. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I had the jacket. It's all right. Go ahead. <laughs> Gender roles. Nah, that's funny. Gender roles. Gender roles have changed since 1960. Most women provide for themselves instead of being provided for. Mm. What do you think the role of a woman should be? Mm. So what I was saying was a lot right now in this day and age, women are taught to work hard, get to the bag, rightfully so. They get into the money, get into the bag, two, three jobs, or even if it's the one good job, they work it hard, making this money. Shout out to all the ladies doing they duck dizzle. So now. Facts. So now, because so because the ladies are getting to the bag now, and they doing all of these wonderful, great, beautiful things in the world for themselves. Shout out to y'all. Should the gen- should 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 the roles change a bit? Should the things that are required from a woman from 1960 be amended and 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 altered somewhat because of the times of them getting to the bag now? They're making more money. They they they're doing more. They're owning property. At one point, women couldn't even have bank accounts. Now they have bank accounts, credit cards, all that other, all those wonderful things. So now, what is it now that we should require from women to be in a relationship? Yeah, I love that question, man. I'm not gonna lie. Like the question, the question for me was so, it was so powerful that like it stopped me in my tracks. Cause you know how sometimes you hear a question and you got a quick answer. You know, and y'all know I'm quick with my my, my mouth. I'm, I'm like, I, motherfucker, I think. That, yeah. But I was like, I, that, that I was like, huh? 
Well, maybe, but it fucked me up. It's like, well, I know you just said it, but 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 what what would we require from a woman who's got it all, right? Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, I understand that we move in a world where, you know, we like, well, I'm still a man. I got, I got dick. I got. Wait, 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 wait. That, that, that's what you took from the question. That's what you took. Well, the way it was posed, even though you read the question, it was pretty much it was a woman saying, you know, the things. You remember all the songs? What's some of the songs? Um, I cook for you, clean for you. Um, as soon as I get home for work, she was like, to you. No, 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 that's got, a baby face song. Baby but but we got it. Wait, at the point, at the end of the day, it's like she's like, I got all that. My bills paid. My rent good. My baby's cool. I'm straight. So, what are you asking me to do? And it just I, fuck. It fucked me up, bro. It, it it really fucked me up because like. A lot of women are making five hundred thousand dollars, millions of dollars. They're good, and it's not that they don't need us. But the question is, what do you need us for? So they was like, so it's not that, not that, not that I need you to be, but it, pretty much she was saying, I got you, Jay. But I'm just trying to clarify it. She was pretty much saying in, in that post, she was what she was saying was, if I can do it all for me. Yes, I need a man. But what's my role now? Right? Like, I got the bag. Like a like a Wendy Williams. Wendy Williams is worth millions of dollars. Uh, I'm not saying that she's pretty yo, up. Wade, I, I hate you. I get how you feel about Wendy, but I'm just I'm just I'm just picking a person. But like what would you, what could you you know like and that's kind of what it was. It was kind of like well what so what's my role? I you want to okay? I, so so I, I, I'm I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this. Um, I don't feel like a man is defined. I say this. I re reiterate or re clear clarify that. I don't feel like a man should be. Personified by just the money that they bring in. Or the dollars that they bring in, mm -hmm. right? Um, if my lady was making thirteen million dollars a year and I was mm -hmm. making ten dollars a year, I still feel like a man's role is to be the provider, the protector, the head of that household. So what? So so let me so let me argue with you real okay. quick. Just let me just take. I'm gonna take you know devil's advocate. Take her point. Okay. So. So she's providing the house because we live in the hills in LA. She's providing the vehicles because she helped you cause co-sign for your shit because nigga, she worth thirteen million dollars. You already know how that go. We got a car together, I put this on her credit. We Gucci. My wife got that. My wife made shit of money. We got butlers, we got nannies for the children. I'm worth twenty hundred million dollars. So because she does that, you know, I got products, things go, you know. I'm drinking something. She's like, well, I make red cups. You know what I'm saying? So she's she's part of the red cup family. She's a multi fucking billionaire. Mm -hmm. She she is now saying, so the old gender roles in the sixties was I need to be here cooking meals for you and make sure that when you come home from work, you good and I gotta be your support. So yeah. she's like, So what what what, what <laughs> you in the penthouse? Mm. I got, a, I, got a, I got a, I got an opinion. So, so talk to me, fellas. That's what I'm saying. That's why I, I, so I, I think I'm, I got I'm, an I'm gonna say this wholeheartedly, right? Um, this whole notion or this whole movement of a man is not needed, or I don't need a man, or whatever, whatever the case may be along those lines, I feel like it's bullshit. Um, I feel like, especially if there are kids involved. There's certain things that I will teach my child that you can't teach. Why? Because I'm let's a not, man, right? If let's, not move, let's not move the goalposts. Cool. Let's take kids away. No kids. Cool. It's me and this me as a single she, man. You as a single woman. We are together. And but, and and that will make a single. But uh, no, no, no. But I, no, okay, I get. No, no, I get. I get. You as a single woman meet this wonderful woman. Yes. This wonderful woman meet you. Yes. And you're at a certain level, which we get. 
Yes. This will be making six figures, but she making eight figures. Cool. So clearly, eight is bigger than six. You know cool. what I'm saying? She can provide for herself at a level that's cool. way higher than us. I'm, 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 I'm going to say this. Love to me is not equated with a dollar. Okay. It's just not. Um, I feel like if me and you were together and you make more, then guess what? We make more. And that's on both sides. If I made more and she didn't, guess what? We made more. To me, it's a collective effort. That's how I see things. So, so yeah. I can't look at a situation like, oh, you make more than me, you wear the pants. Or I make more than you, I wear the pants. I'm not your father. You're not my mother. We are so, now, we, wait, let me go. We are now teaming together. So let me go after we're him. Gonna, we're going to bring resources together to be a better situation, no matter what it is. If you make six figures and I make $10, guess what? We made six figures in $10. It comes down to how we're going to manage this, how we're going to allocate these funds so that we can now have a better life. No? So, so, so what wait, I... Wait, just, I, just, I just got a question before you go, Barry, real quick. So what I'm saying is, all right, I do understand what you're saying. I get that we should be a collective. So I just got to revert it to the question, though. We know that, and, and that's why I fuck with the question, because the question was asking from the standpoint of tradition. Traditionally, yep. men were the breadwinners, women were the, the home homemakers. Yes. So the question is posed, we're not the homemakers no more, because obviously these motherfuckers, you know, women make money now. Mm -hmm. So she's saying, well, what do I do? I can I, can I go? You. I'm... Can I go? 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 What, what, this is just the end of my question, and I'm I'm pretty sure Jake is gonna want to answer it. My the, the question is, I do make more, more money than you, which ain't the problem. The beef ain't about who make more money. The beef is that my gender role as a woman, being that it used to be traditional, has now changed. Can so I? Can I go? You, what do you want me to do with my rich ass? Cool. I got you. I got you. How do I, it, it, I, I got you. I got I you. I got you. Simple answer to that, but go ahead, Barry. It doesn't. It's even to. I'm gonna expound upon what Will was saying. It's not a. It's not about a dollar amount. Cool. You. You making the bag. You. You taking care of home. Financially. Cool. Now you're saying. You know what? Since because I'm doing this, what is my role? It doesn't necessarily have to be Susie Homemaker, but just have value towards my life. Whatever it is that I need from you that I'm lacking in, bring it. Mm. Just like how whatever you're lacking in your life, I'm going to bring that. Mm. Be the incomplete to my incomplete and then we make a complete. Why do we it doesn't it doesn't necessarily have to be anything about necessary bread. If she's making more bread and she makes that kind of money to take care of the bills. Then cool, fine. You know what? Gender roles is out the window. Now cool. We're at this stage. Let's figure out what we need to do together in order for us to be okay. Mm. First. Because clearly money is never an issue. If you're getting to the bag, I don't never need to lend you nothing. Right. I don't even never need to buy you nothing. You will always eat forever. Cool now. Where is it that you show that, sweetie? Cool, not for nothing you you fuck up on time management. Cool. Let me help you out with getting your life in order. Yo, not for nothing. I need to figure out how to I agree. make sure I invest my money better. Cool, baby. This all is right, what I'm right. here for. You, doing a lot. you know what I'm saying? Wait, real quick, real quick, real quick. You doing a lot with the mics, though. Just watch the movie. My, I apologize. But that's right. that's what I'm saying. It's cool. Generals is out the window because you know, men yeah. could be got to be providers, protectors. Or, and I'm not yeah, against yeah. that. But guess what? If providing... Providing in terms of financially is out the window. Then cool, we can we I can remove that, but I can provide a way of teaching you how to save your money. I can provide right. a way of teaching you how to manage your time. It's not yo, it, bro. I said this before in the old episode. I'm gonna say it again. It's not about a monetary it. thing. It's about a value thing. People keep Ooh. putting a price on relationships when we need to understand it's about value. I could be Agreed. broke as a joke. Broke as a joke, but if I come with a value to you and teach mm -hmm. you how to do some shit mm -hmm. and teach you how to do this shit forever, I, I one thing I know about myself, and I could talk, I will be confident and cocky and arrogant and shit about this. Any woman that has ever dealt with me, I have shown them something that will they will train that will take them for the rest of their life and they will always use the shit. Always. Mm -hmm. 
That's something I could talk. I could talk shit about that for a fact. Why? Talk because I know shit, I bring Mark. value. Talk your shit. You know what I'm saying? And that's that. and that's me being really shit. That was a good ass clip, and I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna take that clip and I'm gonna cut that for myself because that was dope. I ain't gonna lie. Go ahead. No, I but that. I'm. Right, yo, it's bro, true. I put. It's true. I. I swear to that's God, bro. Because like, that's that, the difference. And that's actually I could be stuff. broke as a joke, my nigga. I've had times where I ain't had no money in my pocket. But bitch, regardless of what I taught you some shit, and that's value. And you will never forget the shit I showed you. Did he say the B word? Nah, he didn't no. say it. He didn't say it. He didn't say it. You know what I'm saying? It. So people keep, shorty, cool. You making money. I love it, sis. I want my women to get to the bag. Mm. I live with a Jamaican single mother. She's gotten to the bag the whole my whole life. Get Honestly. to it. If real women understood, it's so sexy get to, when your woman gets to the yo, back. Yo, get to the <laughs> back. Yo, baby, it's hey, like, check this out. Yo, I got to work. Yo, ow, she'll, like, she be like, baby, I got to go work. I got to go work this double. Go ahead. You know what? What you want? Me, I, I, you want me to make you an extra plate of food so you could, you know what, I'm saying? What, what you need? I'll pick you up from work so you don't got to take the train I'll, home. I'll, what? Even, I'll even give you more. You ever fuck with a girl that did some shit that was how we do things outside of the box? She was like, "Well, I decided to sell this or that, and then, and then I made twenty thousand. But you made ah, what? Mm. That, ah, ah. It ain't about uh, yo, bro. It's not about money. It's about it's value, amazing. bro. Yeah. You yeah. remove, remove. Yeah. You know, the thing is, a lot of times, people, people. I'm not even gonna leave it under the woman thing because the notion of women wanting oh. to be taken care of is a crazy Shit. thing. We." People be wanting to get taken care of so bad. People are looking to be children in, in relationships and not adults in relationships. And that's the fucked up part about it. Agreed. People want to, I'm going to say it one time. People want to be children in relationships and not adults in it. Somebody's always looking for somebody to just take care of them, do all of these things, pay their bills, wipe their ass, feed them. And then what do they give the person in return? Nothing but headache and a bill. No, 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 no. All right. But I think we got it, man, and I and I think we um we answered it well. And I I, I really like I really like that, that that topic, man. Um, but we got um, what is it? One and a half more. We got We got to keep it moving, y'all. You know, you know. Drop the gun, me. Wade. <laughs> Yo, hey, go. real quick, y'all should see how Wade pressed it. He said like this too. He said, <laughs> Yeah, we got to like, I mean, I love us, but, but um. You know, uh, I want to let's. This person asked me about this Hey Willa Wednesdays, so I feel like we need to do them the service. We did talk about oh, it last shit. week. We got hey to get Wednesdays. to it this week. Um, yeah, we got the Hey Willa Wednesdays. We got a Hey Willa Wednesdays. Hey Willa Wednesdays. Once again, so if you got anybody watching, you got a Hey Willa Wednesdays you want to send to us, to Wade, to Willa, myself, or Damo, please, 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 you can send us emails, texts. DMs, it doesn't matter. We we try to help you out the best as possible. Willa, I put the the. I don't know if you saw it. I put the note in the yeah, group chat. Yeah, I'm looking at it right now. So what is it, man? Talk to me. Let's go. Cool. Um, hey fellas, uh -oh. I've been watching your show for a while now, and I love the growth and consistent change for the better. Keep it up. Mm. Now, I have a dilemma of the heart, and I could really use your help. I'm in love with my coworker. I have been for a while now, and I don't know how to say it to him or tell him. Him and I are extremely close, and he constantly tells me about the horrible women he deals with and, make, and makes him so turned off from dating, it kills me, all capital letters. I get that. What can I do to get him to see me in the space and give me a chance? I think he does find me attractive because he sees men flirt with me on the job. He tells me, I think I can do way better. So help guys. I am so lost and don't know what to do. Yo, this is one of the best. This is one of the best Hey Willow Wednesdays we've had in a while. I think. Don't say that. Don't say that because people be cut right. Don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> Nah, what the fuck you mean? No, I'll tell you, and I'll tell the truth, because a lot of times people just be wanting us to pick the right man or the worst man for you, and and, and be like, well, I, just, I I don't know, that's you, it's on you. I don't, you know. Wait, I'm, I'm I'm trying to find the question. Hold on. But what but can I, I do to get him to see me in the space and give me a chance? I nah, think but, he does find me attractive because he sees men flirt with me on the job. 
he tells me I think I can do way better. So help. I am so lost and don't know what to do. Okay. Do you do y'all got any advice? It's it's wild for me because I'm going through that right now. Oh wow. Okay. Yeah. Wait, was this your Willow Wednesdays, nigga? (laughs) (laughs) You like the nigga? (laughs) Dave, is this something you gotta tell (laughs) us? No, no, not at all. But nah, they're, 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 uh, nah, wow, I get it. Nah, that, 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 I just moved to New York. Um, New York. To I New York. To Atlanta, and there's a chick that um, I, I, I think she's amazing. I do. I think mm. she's fucking incredible. Mm. And we're not friends. I don't know her. Mm. Uh, mm. you know, she wears the crazy weaves and the crazy eyelashes. But I'll be like, yo, it's because I'm in Atlanta. I'm like, yo, if you just didn't, I'm like, I'm going to be the one with her when she finds out that she has beautiful hair and when she cuts it. Like, I'm, oh my God. So I get that. It's like that thing where you, oh. So I so are you in love with your coworker? Yeah. If you, yeah, I'm not in love. But I mean, I see what you're saying. Yeah, no, I fuck with this one. I fuck with it. I fuck with it. No, I, 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 what I, advice? What advice do we have for said individual? Um, I was gonna say one thing. I say to women all the time, men, ladies, it's ladies, not ladies. It's not <clears throat> men are not mind readers. We are not oh. mind readers. Uh-oh. If you feel a way about some shit, you have you have to legit. Tell us. Don't put it in front of our face thinking that we can read between the lines and get context clues. Right. You have to tell us. We are slow that way. That's that. I, I'm being completely 100% honest. Men are not mind readers. I'm not a fortune teller. I'm not Miss Cleo's nephew. None of that shit. Tell me what's up. That's one way. I'm cute about be honest with you. That's one way for you to get son to know what type of time you want with him. To be real with you. If you that bold, that's if you're that bold. I don't know. I can't. You know what I'm saying, if you're not, you you got a disadvantage a little bit. You know. So you got So it's a girl. It's a girl asking, how does she do it with the guy? That's mm-hmm. a tough one because I don't know how to tell a woman to do it right. What? Well, but in in my experience, the illest shit that has ever ever happened to me is when a woman is completely honest with you up front. We as men, we, uh, we, <laughs> I'll say it like this. I'm speaking for y'all. Y'all don't have to agree, but we're not equipped for when women is dead ass honest. We're not equipped to learn and understand what that is. <laughs> like when, when a woman is like, yo, what's, I fuck with you. I want some dick. You'd be like, ah, you lying. You'd be like, ah, you lying. Ah. Like, we break down. We'd be like, ah, you know what I'm saying? But like, like, now mind you. You might have a, you know, you might have an old school swag. We play it off like, <laughs> I, I know, <laughs> but not nah, low key on the inside. <laughs> we like, oh my god, ah! oh my god, like we we be bugging, like we be bugging because we just not used to somebody coming at us like that. So 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 my advice in that situation is be completely honest. You might catch this man off guard. He may have a girl, he may not. You already say he was dating other people. But no, my my advice is, yo, be honest. Because you might fuck around and get that one dude that's like, oh, shit, I just didn't know that. Oh, okay, I'm here to fuck with you. And I don't know about you, fellas. But that's happened to me. I'm going to say a lot, but it's happened to me definitely a few times where a motherfucker hit me mm-hmm. with some... Y'all want to fuck with you. And I was like, really? Uh, okay. <laughs> I, was, I, wasn't, I, wasn't, I wasn't opposed to it. I just I had no idea. <laughs> Come on, Willow, talk to me. What you me? got? That's valid. That's valid. You got any, you got any, you got any advice, Willow? Nah, go ahead, Barry. Go ahead. No, I'm asking if you got any advice. He drunk. Oh, shit. No. Um, I mean, I, I guess what I will do is just piggyback on what Dame was saying. Like, 
I'm I'm very big on keeping it a buck no matter what. Mm. How the fuck but do I know what you got going on if you don't let me know what's going on? Like I'm not a mind reader, so keep it, it but keep it a buck. Um, if, if this is how you're feeling and and this is what's going on, Shorty, you talking about? Then let me refer to the to the to the actual message. I think he finds me attractive, um, because he sees men flirt with me, um, and he thinks I can do way better. So. Help! I'm lost. I don't know what to do. Um, I I would tell you, and I I also would tell that individual to go for what the fuck you want. Like, bro, we too old to be playing these little ass fucking game. If you but like at the me, same check, time, check box but, but yes clearly, or no. Like, I'm, we're we're past that. I'm with you, but you gotta also clearly cl- just insinuating, inferring. Shorty clearly doesn't have the. Damn, she doesn't have the the wherewithal to keep it a buck with son and just say, hey, I like you, fuck it, I love you, and I want to fuck with you. So Clearly, then, so, so so then, closed mouths. I'm bro. I'm I'm sorry. I'm I'm very cut and I'm cut paste copy dry whatever the fucking terminology is. If you're too afraid to say something, you gonna lose that something. That that simple. That to the point the fuck we talking about get to it wade said wade said to just wade said to how about you fake ask a person on a date be like oh let's go out somewhere let's just go somewhere real quick you know i'm saying I, I, I hear you but even that look so i would say to me is a bit too passive aggressive mm. you're straight up saying yo put it on the table what's up yo i want to take you on a date my nigga. and that's that guess what if, if okay so i will say this um us here the three of us on camera plus wade Mm -hmm. this is the four of us here in one room right um Mm -hmm. we have a pretty good read on if somebody fucked with us or not we have a pretty good read on i got a chance for that person or not it's 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 not like we're just shooting into the wind and we hope and i feel like just hit me out this this is my feelings i'm with you feel like people know if they really have a shot or not now, if you're flirting back and forth with this individual and you feel like there's something there, guess what? They may be something there. So if you're too afraid to approach that situation as such or you don't want to fully grasp what's going on and take control of it, you might lose it. And that's just real, bro. We've all been in situations where, how about, you know what? I fucking hate this, but it happens. Oh, Yo, somebody that you follow on social media, you see them out in person, and then after you see them, they message you like, "Oh, oh, I saw you at the, I saw you at, at the, the concert. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw you at the concert. What the fuck? Then say something. Like, the, we we're so afraid of saying something because, that we really want yo, to say that now. You know, that's the social media shit. We so you used gotta, to talking about how these cameras and we typing on these keyboards that we we. We're afraid for the social well, aspect you, of it. And the social aspect is, hey, yo, I like you. What's up? That's and it. Even, gotta... And even if you don't fuck with me in that way, guess what? I, I'm i telling you that I like you, so you know what's up. Like, Bro, no, seriously. Which... No, no, but even what if happened it's to a, that? I'm going to just say, even if it's a fail. Even if she's like, well, you know what? To be honest, I ain't fuck with you like that. In my head, I'm like, cool. But at least I now know where I stand. But you, you gotta know remember, where I stand and that's that. But you gotta Let's remember, to exactly. we over here tippy toeing around the you fact that wait. I like you. You may like but me. Wait, but wait, but wait, but wait, but wait, but wait, but 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 it's Barry. You know, but we we all know how Barry talk. You know, Barry talk around shit. He talking parables. <laughs> so hey, so that. you gotta. Yo, so, so so what's your answer, bro? What's your but answer? But what you gotta also understand is right. Come on now. Fear of rejection is a form of anxiety, legitimately, right? People are scared of rejection, and because of that, you nah, and you can't. No, no, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. We re- <laughs> wait. You wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. Willa, Willa, Willa. One thing you cannot do is take somebody's mental issues or mental problems and say, "Now it's a fuck mental that. issue." Anxiety, <laughs> depression, and 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 rejection is a form legit, bro. It is a form you. of feeling away. Like no, I understand. I you, I wait, you gotta understand something. You. Because we are used to something as men, and the era we grew up in is cool. This is what we had to do growing up. 
People right. nowadays don't feel that same way. It is a form Bro, of a mental. It is refer, a form of anxiety. I, I hear what you talk about. I'm sorry, but fuck you. Let's refer to the words that's been stated. Come on now, mm -hmm. right? I am in love with my coworker. Right. There's no anxiety there. I love ha that nigga. This cool. is a woman. But so I don't I know what to do. Keep reading. Keep reading. Keep reading. Keep reading. I love that nigga. She I've didn't been say nigga for a while. She I didn't say that nigga. Say it or tell it to him, right? Anxiety. I, That's anxiety. Wait, wait. He and I are extremely close, and we flirt. She the said flirt. Fact that he dates Did she other say people, flirt? Did she say flirt? I think he does find me attractive because when he sees me flirt with men on the job, he tells me and thinks I can do better. But that doesn't mean they flirt. What I'm saying is anxiety is a real thing, bro. It is a I, form I'm of sorry, a mental sorry, issue. Listen, 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 listen. Hear me, hear me clearly. We're not fucking dumb here, bro. And this person who wrote this is not fucking dumb. And whoever's listening to us, they're not dumb. If you're going to write a whole parable talking about you find somebody attractive and you love this man and y'all you see up that person sees other people talking to me and they feel a way about it we know what's going on we're not naive to that fact so let's talk to that i hear what you're saying in a perfect world where we don't know how everybody's feeling but you know what's up and you know what's going on at certain times you, bro. you know when you borrow you know when you flirt with somebody and you know when they're flirting back you know when you no, have my, no chance with my somebody. radar broke my radar broke. Yeah, no, no, it, it may be. But what I'm saying is us as people, we know no, I get as you, a sir. collective when somebody fucks with us and we know when someone doesn't fuck with us. This whole thing that I just read to me is I love this man. Mm -hmm. I love him. I do. That's what I'm not said. sure how he feels about me, but I do know that when he sees people flirting with me, he feels away. So mm -hmm. now I'm like, do I pursue it or not? Let's break down the words and let's talk about what's really happening here, right? But at so the same if, time, if, I if can't so afraid, I can't ignore what she I can't ignore what she said before so though. So afraid of the fact you that you can't ignore what she said this, before, bro. No, I, I can't ignore it because now that's how just can now nah, that's bullshit. No, I'm gonna be real with you that you just bullshit. You I, I can't guess. you can't pick and choose what you ignore, bro. That's, I'm sorry, that's, I'm, that's I'm, crazy. Not, I'm not here. I, I personally I'm not here to baby people and I won't baby people because I know how it really is. If I feel something, I'm going to say something. And it should be vice versa because closed mouths don't get fed. And what not the everybody fuck are we like you, about though. Right that's like, what, that, but that's the thing. You got to remember, right. not everybody like you. I, I'm saying. I, I, you don't got to once... be like me, but for you, for you, for not me saying you as in you, Bob. I know what you, you mean. I know For you as the person who wrote this to say you love this person, right? You are that's in love with this person. Bro. You mm -hmm. see how you interact with this person. And you mm -hmm. see how he interacts with you when he sees other people talking to you. They got to be something there. So, so ultimately, I feel like us as a people, let's stop being afraid. Let's really go after what the fuck we want to. This might be a life lesson to whoever is listening. Stop being afraid of what you think may not happen. I agree. Because if I all the signs that. are there, guess what? It very much so will happen. We're so used to talking in, in negativity and talking in pessimistic vibes. It's like, no, put it in the atmosphere. You want that individual, you feel a vibe, guess what? You're going to get that individual, sis. You want that man, y'all single, you single, he's single, guess what? You're going to get that man, sis, and vice versa. Fellas, you want that lady, you single, she's single, you kicking vibes, she's picking up vibes. You have you feel so much vibes that you can type this fucking Willow Wednesdays. Guess what? Go for it. Cause I'm not here to baby you. I'm I'm also not here to pick up your pieces when shit go left because you didn't want to pursue your goal. Go after that. I'm not gonna talk in fucking parables here. Go after it. Period. At the end of the day, man, listen, I love it. I think I think we dispelled a lot of great information tonight. Yeah. Um, go for that shit. Uh, but I always got to be my hall monitor ass. Yo, my say, mom, yo, I, I'm going to say this. My, my, mom, say, my mom told me from young, there's two things you're going to hear. A yes or a no. But if you don't answer, 
you're a piece of shit for not uh, not answer but ask if you don't ask you're a piece of shit for not asking that's true because you didn't get your answer that makes that's, sense that's it i can't argue with that i can't argue with that what the fuck we talking about so, so, stop, so, being, so, stop being scary so so i'm gonna end it i'm sorry you know me i i get to the beat that's why i say a hall monitor listen, <laughs> i'm not even giving again, out demerits <laughs> it's like all right y'all We've been talking Once again, me. y'all, thank you for watching Willow I, Wednesdays. I love y'all. Like, share, subscribe. Bring somebody to church. We got Damo. We got Jay Willa. Go stream them on all social media platforms. Their music. Word. Facts. Um, 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 um. We got Water. We got Skate 107. Skate 107 by Damo, man. Let's get it. That's a fact. That's a fact. Please, we got... Um, Little Nas X reaction video coming out. We got the reaction to the reaction coming out soon for that as well. We got um, the versus we got the reaction, reaction coming to out the too. Reaction. Let's go. Um, yeah. We got yeah. Toxic Fridays. Go check those out Bitch as well. We got me old down. reactions. Bitch said let me down. We got they a fail, whole bro, bunch but, of shit. But, I, but you fucking we got a ghost, whole. Man. We got a whole bunch of shit that's come, that's out on the page right now. Old episodes, all that shit. So go go tune in, subscribe, like. We love y'all. Peace, I told love, the nigga himself would be dope. But anyway, I'm holla I'm at out. y'all later. Holla. Man, I just want to thank you so much for tuning in to Willow Wednesdays. We love and appreciate facts, the facts, support. Facts, facts. Yeah, yeah. If you ain't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button for the YouTube page. Big facts. Yes, yes, yes. And click the bell for notifications. Mm-hmm. And make sure to join that family page, the Willow Wednesday family page on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Peace.